kicks away for Extreme Team, hard at work tonight. They are at the Humane Society. This is their second week there. They're renovating the building from the floor to the ceiling and pretty much everything in between. Kicks away for John Hendricks joins us now live from there. And John, a little preview of the big reveal. We, that, that's not till Thursday, but you're going to show us what's the, going on now. Yeah, there's a lot of cool things that are happening out here. Mark and the gang have done quite a bit of work since the last time I was out here. Now, the cool thing about this project, that they are making it green, a green project. Now, what that means is that they've installed LED lights inside and outside of this building. And Vista installed several lights outside and in over the outside dog walking area. Inside, Mountain State Electric donated LED lights, and they pretty much brighten up the space dramatically. Now, going green for for this project is not only going to benefit the environment, but help cut back on costs as well. Uh, not only are we getting better light, but we're also getting more cost and, uh, efficient, and every penny we save is one more that we can put towards helping animals in need. Now, to make the building even more efficient, Sturm Heating and Cooling came in and balanced out the system to uh, really help and uh, cut down on those heating costs so they can go back to uh, the animals here in need. And uh, this project, the man with the myth legend, Mark <laughs> Peterson, is uh, putting all this together. He's still got a lot of work to do, though, Mark. We do. I mean, we're not done, John, and thank you for that. The environmental aspect to that and saving money and saving energy is huge, but we've also wanted to freshen it up. So I want to show you behind what is going on. we got a couple players. First of all, VPI, custom built and VPI Home Solutions put in all the windows. They're of course low E, they're going to be um, uh, dual paned. That's going to help their vinyl. Now, JW Masonry, Johnny came in, he built all that brick facade literally in an hour and a half. I'm telling you, the man is huge. And then here we also have, hi Dave, this is where we've got this brick, the 4x4 four four posts. We're going to box those out, really giving it a modern feel. It's going to look really nice, and it's going to be one of those things that's going to last forever. Um, also, now, Garco is one of our big players. They're the general on this, and they've got their crew, and Scott and Wayne have been here. So they came in, and now we're putting out this metal with an extra door. So that's going to not only help when the winner is here, and they're going in and out because it's going to be sort of a, a, a block but it's also going to allow for the dogs not to be able to run out with the single door. Where we're standing, guys, this is where we're going to have the Wilbert precast 4x6 pavers. And right here is where we're going to have some plants. So it's going to open it up. We've also got a pretty good option on getting some beautiful areas to sit, relax, and chill. We have a flagpole that we're going to put up. It's going to be um, lighted throughout the night. And again, Mountain States Electric, Bruce, your crew, Trish, everybody, they've been working tirelessly to make sure all the electrical in here is not only safe up to code, but also we're going to put a big light, big pole right there so that the American flag will fly and will be lighted throughout the night. It's going to be wonderful. They do have a flag light there, but we're putting a real one in, you know, the one that's down below, and then it goes up and lights it up. So tomorrow, here's what's going on. Everhart painting with Rada paint. We're going to have at least 30 people in here through tomorrow. They're going to be painting not only the back rooms, but the front room. Uh, Galen Hagen, dear friend of mine, also a contractor, is getting the walls prepped. We're going to have those sanded tomorrow, and they'll be ready for paint. The flooring is done. We're ready to go at 6 o'clock. Maybe I'm going to show you the new floor. Absolutely beautiful, and here's the deal. Hmm. Almost impervious to problems. It's just going to be a sweep and mop a couple times a week and it's going to hold up. So all of that coming up at 6 plus we'll tell you a little bit more of what's coming up. We have a few surprises. We'll share those with you in just a little bit. I can't believe the transformation that you're just showing us on the outside. It looks like a completely different building, Mark. I know. It's, it looks like it came out of the 19th century. It's like the yeah. Brady Bunch finally <laughs> aged. <laughs> Work well done. I know you guys are working around the clock too, so uh, we'll talk to you at 6 o'clock.